Hello everybody and welcome back to more. Let's play Final Fantasy 7. Hey, what's up, Sid? President Sid, Ca Captain Sid. In the last episode, we came here to Rocket Town and we found the big rocket place. And in this episode, we're gonna find some rocket power. Or something, I don't know. I went and I talked to the captain, who is Sid. And he did not have much of anything to say to me, so I don't know what else to do. Um... At the very least, though, I'm in a town, so I don't have to worry about getting attacked by monsters, which is nice. Maybe I should go back and talk to someone more of the townsfolk, now that I've talked to Sid again. Hmm. Okay, well, I went and I talked to the captain. Everyone in this town was a... Okay, cool. Yeah, it just looms there. That's how the town got its name. Shimmer number 26. We want to look after the rocket with me? Yeah, sure. Let's take a look. Oh, look at that rocket. That's a nice rocket. So big and made of metal. Man, that's a nice rocket. Look at it. It's such a rocket. I get so impressed every time I look at it. Sorry to get in. Sorry to get you into this. For me, it's a kind of hobby. But out of appreciation, let me give you this. Oh, Yoshiyuki, I wish you'd take care of it and use it. What? Okay, what is it? Oh, it's a sword! Sword is used when an ally is down? What? Is it an equipable thing? Is it... Is it a new sword for Cloud? Yes, it is. Sword is used when ally is down. What does that mean? Does it give me does it give me the ability to freaking What does it do? What does that even mean? When an ally is down, does it give me restore does it give me revival magic or something? I never went over to see what's over here. Let's see what's over here. Whoa, bro, you you right there? Mm, I'm so bored. Isn't there anything that can excite me? How about I burn your house down with a, I'll get my engineers to invent a combustible lemon that burns your house down. Anyway, um, all right. Jeez, it's boring. Isn't anything exciting gonna happen here? I s something tells me that I'm going to launch the rocket somehow. Gigantic rocket. I found a power source earlier. That's that seems like the logical conclusion this would all lead to. Let me see, do I know any good jokes? Okay, you say the same thing. Something tells me you may want to go get checked for any sort of, uh, you know, dementia-related disease. Uh, let's see. Let me hear your story. Since had some bad breaks, it's really no one's fault. He couldn't go into space. Just bad luck, I guess. Okay, what about you there, fine sir? Hey, yeah, buddy, talk to me. A drink will ease your heart. I guess I'll have a drink. If he keeps up like that, he's gonna collapse someday, you know what I mean? I'm talking heart attack. And that's all you have to say? Of course. So I need to help Sid go into space. And you're still taking a crap. Okay, that's a long, long poo. No thanks. What? Wait, what about you? What do you have to say? Hmm, is it real or fake? Is what real or fake? Turn around! Uh, here in Rocket Power Town, there's not a whole lot to see or do, is there? That rusted out rocket is all that remains of Shinra's space program. Yep. Gotcha. Got it. Yep. Welcome to the item shop. No, thank you. I don't really want any of your- I'm not interested in what you're selling, in what you're- what you're talking about. I don't dig what you're laying down. Do you have anything to say? All Gramps does is gaze at the rocket all day. Okay. Ah, jeez, man. Where am I supposed to go? Oh, excuse me, Cloud. There, see, I, I did a thing. Did the captain say anything? Nope. Oh. Ah, uh, Cheryl, what are you, blind? We got guests, get some tea! Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, that's Sid, you're being mean. 
Really, don't mind us. Shut up, sit down in those chairs and, tr and drink your goddamn tea! Ugh, Sid. Why is- why is Sid like this? I mean, I'm, it's, he has good reason to be like this, but if he's always as angry in this game, why would- wouldn't he be angry in all- in the other games that he appears in, too? I mean... Make sure to serve him some tea, alright? Okay, thank you, Sid. We're gonna- gonna have lots of tea. It's gonna be tea time. Sheesh, what bad manners. Yeah, you're no kidding. Sorry, it's our fault. Oh no, he's always like this. It's amazing that you can live with that. No, it's because of my stupid mistake. I was the one who destroyed his dream. What? Get your ass in gear, you work like a snail. Even the moon would get tired waiting around for your ass. Sid, why are you so mean? I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Don't take so much time checking that oxygen tank. Oh, being careful is good, but no matter how many times you check that oxygen tank, it won't matter. The thing won't break even if hell froze over. But, no buts. You're not... You're not stupid, so be more efficient. I'm sorry. Our dreams are finally coming true! Yeah, the orange carrot people are finally gonna go to space! Captain, preparations are complete, all that's left is liftoff. Ha! <laughs> ha! Yeah! Leave it all to me, I'll be back in a few. Awesome, sir, yes sir, etc, etc, ad nauseum. Alright, Captain, fly our dreams into outer space! Yay! Thanks, guys. We're praying for your safety. Instrument panel all clear. Shimmer number 26 ready for launch. Woohoo! Engine pressure rising. Three minutes to launch. Beginning countdown. Woohoo! We're gonna go to space! Oh no! Sirens! Emergency! Mechanic is still in the engine section. Oh no! What? I don't know. I th oh, of course it's hurt. Checking the oxygen tanks! It's hey, Sarah, Captain. Don't mind me. Go ahead with the launch. You can't be in there! I was still concerned. The results of the oxygen tank tanks weren't satisfactory. Ugh! It's gonna get so hot in there, you're gonna... There ain't gonna be crap left when we blast off. You're gonna be burnt to a crisp. You're gonna die. You know that, don't you? I don't mind. Yes, you do! If I can fix this... If we uh, starting the engine. Wait a minute, Shara's still in there. What are you gonna do, Sid? If we cancel now, it won't be another. It'll be another six months until the next launch. Uh. Tank number seven is complete. Once I complete tank number eight, it's all clear. Come on, Shara, hurry up! You're gonna die. Thirty seconds until ignition. Oh no! Forget about her. We won't make. Oh come on! Wait, why is the crew insisting that I murder our scientists? Oh God! What am I supposed to do? You're supposed to friggin' stop the plane! It said it will- Nothing's bad's gonna happen, you just have to wait another six months. Oh my god, I need to friggin' twist this microphone back into place. Oh man, the moon, outer space, my dreams, oh no! Oh no! Stop the thing! Stop! No! Oh god. Oh, that's, uh, that's not how that would work. Oh, no. That would fall completely over. There's nothing stopping it from falling over. There's nothing stopping that freaking rocket from falling over. If it... If it has four points that it stands on, and it is leaning upon one of those points that... Oh my god. After that space program was cut back after the launch was cancelled, it's my fault his dream was destroyed. Well, yeah, it kind of is. That's why it's alright, I don't care what the captain says, I'll live my life for him. Okay, alright, alright, this this all could have been avoided if Sid would have just been, would have just not been an idiot, or if the crew would have not been idiots, and said, okay, everybody's where they're supposed to be, awesome, now we can launch the ship, instead of, oh, wait a minute, there's somebody in the engine room and they're going to die. Oh my god, this game is so stupid, alright. Jerry, you still haven't served tea! Oh no. 
Hurry up and sit down, or ain't my hospitality good enough for you? Alright, let's... yeah. They're late, where's Rufus? Hey, long time no see, so Sid, how you been? Well, if it ain't Fat Man Palmer, how you been figuring on keeping me waiting? Okay, alright, awesome, fantastic. It's muy, muy fantastical. So when's the space program gonna start again? I don't know, the president's outside, why don't you ask him? Ah, oh, good for nothing. <laughs> don't say fat. Err. Hey, T, can I have some too with lots of sugar and honey and oh yeah, don't forget the the lard? Oh my god, okay. Alright, that's that's gross. Hey, have we met before? Yeah, I think I killed your boss. Who drinks tea with lard? Okay, well, let's uh let's go outside and see what all the fuss is about. You got me all excited for nothing? Then what'd you come here for? We want to borrow the tiny Bronco. Going after Sephiroth, but it seems we've been going in the wrong direction. But now we think we know where he's headed, so we have to cross the ocean, but that's why we want your plane. First the airship, then the rocket, and now the tiny Bronco. Shinra took our outer space room, and now I want to take the sky from me too. Oh my, you seem to forget it was because of Shinra Inc. that you were able to fly in the first place. What? Uh, excuse me? This way. You wanted to use the tiny Bronco, right? I believe Palmer's going to take it, so why don't you talk to him? Is Palmer out back with said tiny Bronco? The tiniest of Broncos? Uh, why do I have to do this? I'm the head of the space program. Did you have- did you enjoy your lard tea? We'll be taking the tiny Bronco. I've seen you somewhere before, yes. I know, the Shinra building when the president was killed. Oh, s s security Oh, good. Well, I guess we're gonna kill the fat man. Oh, good. That was a... Boosh! Oh, jeez. Good... Good job, Eris, you did it. Oh, jeez. Huh, alright. Well, it seems to hurt everybody. And it uses- what? Well, we're hick, 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 hick. Alright, here, have some fire. And have some- have some lightnings. Oh, dang, son. Kabooshk. Heh 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 heh. Now let's see. I just wonder how long this is gonna take to kill him because this isn't a boss fight, this is a joke. Something tells me that I could steal that Mako gun from him, but I don't have the ability to do so right now because I haven't. I haven't gone to a save point. I don't have any steel materia like on my person that I can use. Let's let's summon Shiva. Why not? Ouch! My face. Summoning Shiva. Okay. All right. I'm just I'm just being dumb. Actually, wait a minute. Let's use Seal Evil. Would that would that apply to his Mako gun? Let's see if it works. Hehe. Hehe. Ah, crap. What are you What are you doing? What are you doing? Just, uh... Oh! Oh, jeez! Who's- who's driving the plane? What? Oh, jeez! <laughs> okay! Um... We did it? We won, I guess? Eris leveled up, that's- that's good. 
We got an Eden coat. What just happened? Why was the plane moving? There was nobody in it. Yes. We... Yeah, that, that looks good. Do that. Oh my god. That... That looks so wrong. The... The digitized... Like... Oh my god, that looks so strange. This is not right. This is not how you're supposed to do this. Nobody's flying the plane. There is nobody in the cockpit. That's wrong. I'm sorry, Sid. We're stealing your plane. Or maybe we aren't. Who knows? Okay. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeebus. But we have a plane! Oh, the tail's been hit. Oh, no! Emergency landing! Oh, no! Why is it called a tiny Bronco? It's gonna be a big splash. Hold on to your drawers and... Okay. Alright, Sid. You can, you can stop with the foul... with the foul language. Huh. So it would seem that our idea of stealing a plane didn't work too well. Can't we use another boat? Yeah, let's do whatever you want. Well, you're out here too, so screw off, Sid. Mm. I'm history with the Shinra, and I've given up on that town. What about your wife, Shara? Wife, don't make me laugh. Just thinking about marrying her gives me the chills. Oh, God. What are you guys going to do? Uh, we're going after a man named Sephiroth. Gotta get to Rufus of the... We'll have to get Rufus of the Shinra someday, too. I don't know about any of that, but... Ah, uh, what the hell. Sign me up. How about it, everyone? Do whatever you want. Glad to be on board. Numbskull. Oh, come on. Anybody stupid enough to go against Shinra now? It's gotta be a numbskull. I like it. So, where are we headed? Rufus was going to the Temple of the Ancients. No skull kid was telling me he was heading the wrong direction, so maybe it's off this way. Head for land and get some more information. Temple of the Ancients, that name bothers me. Uh, of course it does. Let's catch a button. Across shallow waters and rivers, players can get on and off on the beach. Okay. Yay, I found land. We did it. That wasn't a very dire situation, now was it? Okay. Well, hmm. Can't, yeah, can't go that way. It's only a matter of time until I get attacked. Of course. It's always as soon as I say it, isn't it? Oh, good. Pokemon. Huh. Oh. Eek. I mean, hey, using Cure is still really effective. See, there was a guy telling me in the comments that using Cure was not very useful for my current level and my current HP needs. It totally still is. Oh, God. All right. Oh, good. Oh, no. And Vincent's dead. Of course. Oh, no, he's not. All right, awesome. What are you? No. Oh, come on. Seriously? That's right, refill all my HP. Oh good, Cloud's dying of poison. Oh no, everyone's... Uh, okay, this is not going well. Um, oh god.
Why? Wait, what? Oh, yeah, that's right, because he was poisoned. Ah, damn it. Okay. That's... Uh... Oh my god, stop it! Oh my god, enough! I've had it up to here with your disingenuous assertions! Oh my Jesus! Ah, stop it! Ouch! Let me guess, it heals all of them. Nope, okay, awesome. Da -da 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 -da. Cloud is dead! They were worth a lot of experience, though. Alright, friggin... Good thing I bought so many Phoenix Downs. Oh, God. Uh, jeebus. Alright. Oh, good. It's gonna break? It's not gonna break. Awesome. Is there a town somewhere around here? We're getting into, like, so- Oh, God. <laughs> there is, like, no color anywhere around here. I'm just exploring around because there's probably something useful somewhere. Ah, uh, freaking bollocks. Oh, good. At least, you, at least I don't have to deal with any more of those birds. Jeez. But then again, I don't know what you are. Oh, okay. Okay, well, you're not terribly strong, so I guess that's fine. Ouch. Ouch. Oh, good. Poisoning everyone, probably. Nope, but almost. Ah, oh, jeez. Is it just me, or is it a little creepy that the green glow effect does literally everything but their eyes? It's just not right. It would be nice if um, Healing Wind also cured Poison, but I guess not. And if I'm not mistaken, Poison doesn't stay after battle is over, does it? Maybe? There's an X-Potion. I'm just gonna guess that they're like... Fully restores HP. Awesome! I'm starting to get like full-on... Full-on boop scoop a doop a doop what is over here? Absolutely nothing, it seems. There better be something useful on this little peninsula right here. Oh, there's a bridge. It leads to another place. Oh, goody goody gumdrops. Where does this go? Leads over to yet another peninsula with nothing on it, it seems. Awesome. Bam, 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 bam. Haha. Glorious! Oh, good. What does that do? Nothing, it seems. Okay. Hibbush! Something tells me it has like a really low hit percentage, but its effect is probably devastating because, you know, why would it not be? It's this game. Yet another Phoenix down. I will take that. Gladly. Oh, oh, is, no, I was about to say, is that a little tent? But no, it's just a rock formation. Okay. Ooh! There's a town! Ch Chinatown. Okay, and a save point. Awesome. Uh, well. Ooh, ooh, weapons. Hey, yo, welcome. We got some of the best blades right out of the furnace. So strike while the iron's hot. Yay! Weapon. I can have a weapon. Well, uh, let's get a diamond knuckle. Get the, get the aura rod. Gold barrette. Oh, I don't have enough money. Ah, oh, but they're so they're they are such the good weapons. Okay. All right. After I after I go weapon weapon shopping all in this episode. Uh. Did I 
already... Ah, oh, crap. I bought- I just bought the Aurora Rod and then I sold it and had friggin' balls to the wall. I did that completely wrong. Put on the Aurora Rod. Crap. Let's give him his new weapon, the short barrel. He has an extra slot. Give him long range. Give him barrier, why not? So so as to. Okay, sure, let's try that. See how that works. Anyway, thank you all for watching this episode of Let's Play Funal Fantasy 7. In the next episode, we're gonna explore this here Chinatown, and we're gonna do all the things, all of them. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.